When we approach decision-making tasks with patients, we tend to do the same thing for everyone. And that's probably not the best approach, but it's the easiest for us in really busy clinical practices. So when we've researched this topic, what we find is um, oncologists and other cancer care clinicians basically tend to develop these scripts. And uh, they become very expert at sort of recycling these very short, dense, information-laden speeches that they deliver to patients. And uh, it makes you feel really expert, and it seems like you're doing a really excellent job. You're conveying all this very complicated information in a very efficient way to patients and families. Unfortunately, what we don't often do is go back and check in about what they understood. And we tend to just talk too much, and we talk at people, and we dump data on them. So one important point for oncologists is to uh, think about how much they're talking versus how much the patient is talking. And to be explicit about asking people up front, how do you like to make decisions? Do you want to be more actively involved? Do you want to be more passively involved? Do you want me to give you a recommendation? Um, are you someone who wants to read about everything and learn about everything and know all of the information, come back later and make a decision? Are you someone who kind of operates in the middle, getting a sense for how they want to make the decision? And then also asking, how do you like to receive information?